CBS 11 Selena Hernandez has more on their efforts to save Christmas. So we're still looking at a need for 4,000 toys for children. The need is great, yet the supply is limited. At the Cowboy Santa's workshop, rows of shelves sit practically empty, a grim indication that donations are dwindling. Right now, these children are looking at not having anything unless we can provide it for them. The organization has been making Christmas merry for deserving families for the past 28 years. Right now, everybody needs a little help. This year, we're told the economic climate has increased the need for assistance. The average income for the families that we serve is about $11,000 a year. For families, it's the help they desperately need in a tough economy. It means a whole lot to me because right now, you know, we've got the recession going on and everything kind of hard. We're trying to pay bills and everything, and it's kind of hard for us to get stuff for our children. Yet the Cowboy Santa's efforts of supplying tidings of comfort and joy this holiday are at risk. We're told this morning there weren't enough toys to give away, and families had to wait as crews scrambled to fill requests. The need is, is now again. And, uh, and we're hopeful that, uh, that some of the community will uh, see their way to, uh, to help out either making a cash donation or a toy. As the Cowboy Santas prepare for two more rounds of toy giveaways, the only thing these elves want for Christmas is a little help from the community. Please give. Just, just remember what Christmas was like when you were a child and, and, and look deep down into your heart and into your pocketbooks and help us serve these children. In Fort Worth, Selena Hernandez, CBS 11 News. And CBS 11 News is a proud sponsor with Cowboy Santas. If you'd like to help make Christmas gifts possible for deserving children, head to our website, cbs11tv.com, for a link on where and how you can donate to Cowboy Santas.